to our other big focus this morning. The chit fund scam in West Bengal is getting bigger, with SEBI turning the heat on a dozen other companies running similar Ponzi schemes. And people are rushing to withdraw 20,000 crores invested in these companies. Market regulator SEBI has asked the government to look into operations of all these companies. One such company is the Rose Valley Group, which has now approached Mamata Banerjee seeking protection. Its chairman, Gautam Kundu, wrote to the chief minister on April 23rd, saying that the group has assets worth 10,000 crores and that his depositors were not at risk. SEBI has been trying for years to shut down Rose Valley, but in vain. The market regulator also has its eyes on MPS Green Bay developers, but the local courts had stayed SEBI's orders. For more, let's get in a word uh, from our correspondent Shagato Mukhopadhyay who is joining us live from Kolkata this morning. Shagato, the fate of other companies also hanging in the balance, increased pressure on them not just from the investors but also from the market regulator. That's absolutely right, uh, Simi, because uh, uh, after the collapse of Sharda, there's been a widespread panic among depositors. And, and there are, you know, there are lakhs of depositors spread across West Bengal who have kept their money in several such uh, uh, such companies which are running CIS, you know, collective investment schemes. And, and these are under, not just under the scanner of the SEBI, but currently after the collapse of the Sharda group, it's the SFIO, severe fraud investigation office uh, they have also uh, now come into the picture they are now uh, you know uh, conducting investigations on the on the on the operations of, of companies such as Sharda group and rightly you pointed out hmm. one such company is the Rose Valley group the Rose Valley is uh, has already written a letter to to Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee if I may show you the letter this is the letter that they have uh, written to Mamta Banerjee it's dated 23rd of April so it's basically uh, only a few days after after uh, the the, uh, the Sharda group went bust, and it is now seeking protection from uh, the Mamta uh, from the Mamta Banerjee government, saying that it has assets worth around 10,000 crore rupees. There is a buzz that this company already has uh, you know savings to the tune of around 2,000 crore rupees and can pay off their depositors. It is in fact saying in this letter to Mamta Banerjee that uh, it has started making pre-maturity payments, but it is apprehending backlashes from ill mongers so it's say you know the, the 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 pressure is not just from inside in the sense that depositors have 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 now queued up outside the uh, you know offices of rose valley and companies like rose valley but yes there is also a serious intensification of scan on companies such as this such as rose valley by uh, agencies like sebi like agencies uh, by agencies such as the sfio and Simi? these companies are turning to Mamta Banerjee. Shokoto, thanks so much for that update.